Welcome to The Breakdown. I am your host, Diane Rembert, avid reader, award-winning literary blogger, and the founder of Diamond's Literary World, which is my footprint in the literary industry. It is my sincerest desire to bridge the love of words, sentences, paragraphs, and books to whomever has a like passion. Today we'll be talking a little bit about a book I recently read um, and absolutely fell in love with. It may have a little bit to do with the fact that I know the author. Um, she is absolutely one of my favorites. Um, if you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about Miss Brenda Hampton. And the book we'll be discussing today is In My Shoes. Boy, I have to take a deep breath before I begin this one because the Brenda Hampton that you see today is not the Brenda Hampton of this book. It is somewhat autobiographical. Um, she lays it all out in, on the table um, from early childhood until becoming a teen mom of twin daughters. Um, the things that her and her sister, um, sisters, excuse me, endured in their household. Um, she talks a lot of her mom. Um, I was fortunate enough to meet one of her sisters, uh, Joyce. And as I'm reading the book, I'm visualizing the things that they went through in their teen years. Um, and, and how... Brenda Hampton, she, she kept her name. Um, she did not change her name, but she changed the names of the, the various other characters. However, um, as a teen mom, the things that she went through in order to provide for her daughters. Um, and I don't think that any of us would blink to do some of the things that she did. Um, I won't go into details because I definitely want you to pick up this book. Um, it talks about various relationships um, with guys and, and if you have read her uh, Naughty series, um, you will see one of your favorite characters, one of our favorite characters, Jalen. You will see where he does make an appearance in the book. Um, so it's definitely a, a page turner, one that I've had in my uh, treasure chest for quite some time, um, but I have been hearing so much about it that I decided to pick it up, and I'm so glad I did. I could almost kick myself for not reading it sooner. Um, it's definitely one that I would recommend that you give to any teenage mom to let her know that, you know, no matter what it looks like, there is definitely life on the other side. You can make better of your situation. It's all about the choices that you make. Um, and she talks about this repeatedly in the book. I would also recommend it for anyone that is struggling with um, what to do with their life. Um, because sometimes we, we we're unsure and we don't know and and so we just allow ourselves to fall into um a situation and, and then remain there we get stuck but we it's like water moving bodies of water we have to keep moving and we have to keep growing and it's definitely evident in this book you see the transformation from young rebellious um girl to the businesswoman, the entrepreneur, the phenomenal writer that we know today. So again, please go pick up In My Shoes by Miss Brenda Hampton. I'm sure it's somewhere behind me. Um, welcome to Diamond's Corner. Um, it's somewhere behind me, but I don't want to uh, pick it up and take away from the content. So what I will do is post a link to the book. Um, for you to see and to go check out you can go to amazon.com also Barnes and Noble but I like to tell people to check out the author herself because from what I know of Brenda Hampton she has all she always has um, books 
that to be sold. So inbox her. If you see her at a literary event, go and support her. Go tell her hi. Um, if you have not read the book yet, please go pick it up. Until next time, thank you for watching. Also, tell a friend to tell another friend to tell yet another friend about the breakdown here at Diamonds World. Um, thank you for subscribing to the channel, and I hope to see you soon.